Ginger Dugavolo is continuing to find her own path forward. In an exclusive interview with People, she's opening up about her journey to freedom and how she's now strong enough to speak on her experiences, which was not always the case. I remember whenever I was first coming out of these teachings, I just spent a ton of time just like working through it myself. Yeah. And I was not at the place to speak. I did not feel strong enough. I'm just so grateful every day for um, just the freedom that I've found. I think the freedom being one that I've said over and over though, but it's it's it really is not this freedom from like, I'm gonna throw off all of my religion in my relationship with Jesus, but I still hold that as what is most important to me and that's what I value the most. These days, she admits her life looks different from what it used to be. A lot of people would look at it and say, man, like you are not holding to these outward things that people could gauge your, your Christianity on. So I'm not gonna wear skirts only anymore. And there are those different things that, you know, even as I have, we have uh, two young girls that we're raising, my, our daughters, um, their lives will probably look different than mine. Ginger's family has been making headlines amid Prime Video's explosive new docu-series, Shiny Happy People, Duggar Family Secrets. The shiny happy images is the sugar, and we're all high on it. They were just deceiving us all. The real story is a much bigger one. I was actually approached um, and asked to participate in the docu-series, but I thought that from my perspective, I really wanted to make sure that I was able to share my story and um, in my own words and in my own timing. So that's why I had wrote uh, Becoming Free Indeed was to share more of um, my journey out of IBLP's teachings and I wanted to be able to share it um, in a way that was like God honoring and hopefully sharing my story in a balanced way.